Welcome back, YouTubers. It's uh, TwiPod002 coming at you with an update. Uh, I'm sure some of you have seen the, um, the picture slideshow that I put up of the uh, GMC 72 GMC pickup truck. Um, here's what I got left of uh, the pickup back end parts. Um, some scrap left over here. Um, I'll show you what I came up with. As as you've seen on the uh, the pictures, I have added some stuff. I added the light bar uh, out of 316 styrene square tubing. I uh, put lights up on the top. Uh, the lights are made from some chrome parts that I found in my chrome parts bin. And I painted them uh, amber. For emergency lights, the uh, the spotlights are from my 49 Merc. Put them on there facing backwards. Used a uh, fuel cell from a tea bucket and uh, used cable, thin uh, cable for the uh, the tow cable that goes on the truck. Also use black and white, ca uh, black and red cable for jumper cables. It sits back in there. Some tires, some exhaust system parts. <clears throat> this is pretty much what I come up with. I was looking for. I've been looking for a uh, tow truck for my diorama for quite a while, and couldn't come up with anything. So I said, "Well, what the hell? I'll just build my own." Um, get some, put some decals on here. Uh, Twenty-four hour mechanic. Conoco garage, uh, Phillips 66, batteries repair, service, and tires. Up underneath here, I put a toolbox on both sides, exhaust coming out the side. The old location for the rear wheels was right up here. So I moved them all the way to the back. And uh, you know, if you go back one, one video, you can uh, see exactly how I built the framework to hold this stuff. Um, I'm just going to flip this over. I'll lose all my parts, but uh, just so you can see what I did underneath. This is the old location here for the uh, where the axle was. What I did was drill the hole in the back end and put another drive shaft into that. So it's it's almost like a universal. And it comes back into a shortened drive shaft into the Chevelle rear end that I mounted on the square stock styrene. And I ran my uh, axle through the styrene. That's how I did the bottom end. <clears throat> Get it back up on its wheels. And uh, yeah, just to make it look like a work truck, I just I threw some tires and some parts in there. And you know, it looks pretty nice. I knocked one of the lights off. Damn it. There we go. Just have to, I'll have to fix that again. But uh, I did notice I forgot to put brake lights on the back, so that's the only thing I have to do. On the sides there, I did uh, bare metal foil, um, painted the lighting rack, which I made out of the 316th uh, square stock styrene. That's pretty much uh, what I came up with. My cars fit on there real nice, and uh, that's what we got. Homemade flatbed tow truck, 125th scale. You can't find them anywhere. The only ones you can find is 135th. All right, uh, enough of that. Off to uh, what my son is doing right now. We went to Michael's, 40% uh, off today uh, in the newspaper. We picked up a 68 Corvette Roadster Revelle. I uh, picked this kid up for 17.99. Got it for nine bucks. Not a bad deal. Uh, and when you go into Michael's, when you get your receipt, save your receipt. It's got 50% off on it. They do that every couple of weeks. But uh, <clears throat> he's got his motor assembled over there, that little orange thing back there. Um, there's the body. He's going to have uh, gold valve cover gaskets, gold carburetors. Uh, he's building the uh, the custom version, so... It's got two two hoods he can use. He's probably going to go with the scoop hood. Um, we've got two different tops, rag top and hard top. But he's going to leave it convertible. But I told him 
finish the top so you can slip them on and slip them off as he wants to. But uh, that's what we got so far right there, guys. Uh, I want to send a quick uh, shout out to all my buddies out there, Fast Jimmy 71 Crazy Man. Um, uh, I can never remember everybody. You know who you are. Uh, you know, we, we do uh, chat back and forth on videos. Uh, I can never, just never remember, you know? Getting old is a bitch. <laughs> Every time you think you, you got everybody in your head, you go to plug them and mention them, and you got nothing. <laughs> you guys will get there one day. <laughs> anyway. That's what we got for now. Um, you know, rate, comment. Uh, if you have any questions, you know where to email me on uh, on YouTube, or you can reach me on my direct email, which is twiprod001 at att.net. <coughs> for now, guys, I'm going to sign off. It's late. I'm starting to get tired. So that's it for today. I'll be updating during the week. We'll be talking to you soon. Peace.